Ascending to the heights. That's what we tend to think of when talking about Colorado. In this case, though, we're descending to the depths. This is a land of extremes, where you can go from some of the highest places in the country to the lowest, and there is adventure everywhere in between. Today, we're starting here at the top, Pikes Peak, the 14,000-foot pinnacle of the southern front range of the Rocky Mountains, where you can look down on the world while, surprisingly, racing to the top of it. Since 1916, the Pikes Peak International Hill Climb has taken racers in cars, motorcycles, even ATVs up into the clouds. Pikes Peak has such a, a rich history. Pikes Peak to me is my Indy 500. It's what I, it's what I look forward to every year. Um, and it, it's, it's something that I can control because we can build our own car. And, and it's not, we, don't, we, we don't have to buy somebody's spec car to come race. You can build your own creation. That opportunity to build is one of the aspects of the race that has inspired amateurs to try their hand at scaling the peak. The race is open to everyone, and anyone who is interested can make the climb up this steep grade. Now, you won't find all of your adventure here in the thin air, though. As you descend an elevation from Pikes, you come to the small town of Canyon City. This is your middle ground, where ATV trails head out into a more desert environment, or you can explore the old railroad grades of Phantom Canyon. The remnants of Eon's past can still be found in the dry rocks of this area as well. I toured with Ina Finch from Indian Springs Ranch and found a world I never expected to discover out here among the brush. All of this was underwater about 12 million years ago. The interesting thing about this is that this is so perfectly preserved and we've had a paleontologist argue why, if this is, how does this look this way? Those squiggles in the rock are the petrified paths of invertebrates and insects. But what scientists can't figure out is how they were preserved in this way. It's a mystery visitors are invited to solve. To the south of the ranch and the winding paths of Phantom Canyon, we finally reach the bottom. Here, the Arkansas River cuts through the rock and forms the Royal Gorge. Now, an amusement park of sorts has sprung up here, complete with what until recently was the highest suspension bridge in the world. The bridge was built in about six months and uh, by about 80 men with wow. uh, no fatalities, no serious injuries. The bridge platform is actually 996 feet above the Arkansas. Right now we're about 1178 feet above the Arkansas River on uh, the one of the attractions here in the in the park which is the aerial train. We, we have over you know 21 ride shows and attractions in the park uh, uh, including this aerial tram and incline railway which takes you 1550 feet down to the bottom of the gorge uh, at a 45 degree angle which is a tremendous ride. And that is how you get to the bottom of Colorado, where the Arkansas flows through a tight crevasse. Colorado is a land of adventure and extremes. And whether you're starting at the top in a race car or heading to the bottom by railroad, you're going to find a spring thaw that is unlike anything else in the West. Now you can find out more about these individual excursions on our website, AYLTV.com, and the Pikes Peak Hill Climb will take place June 22nd through the 27th, and you can sign up to race or volunteer at PPIHC.com. From a mile high and still at the bottom, I'm Stephen Human for At Your Leisure. Hey guys, if you liked that video, you're gonna wanna watch all of our other AYL videos. You're gonna wanna like it, you're gonna wanna share it, and you're gonna wanna subscribe, right? See all the buttons right here? <laughs> this is what you're gonna wanna do, click, right? Click, click, click. Click on them, because we have some really cool videos, all kinds of behind the scenes stuff, bloopers of Alicia crashing and stuff. Why are you gonna sell me out like that, Steven? <laughs> so you wanna click all of these things and subscribe to our channel, because At Your Leisure is awesome, and uh, we'll see you here for more videos.